Hello and welcome back to Unboxing Things. With Lunar New Year around the corner, we can look forward to things like red packets, delicious food and stuff like that. And as is customary in most Asian countries, we need to find ourselves some new clothing to dress up and usher in the new year. This year, I headed out to Burberry to get myself some nice clothing. So as per usual, the packaging you're gonna see are the packages that are available in the Singaporean stores. This is what the bag looks like when it comes from the Burberry store. Nice gold foil prints and the classic Burberry logo down the front. I'm a little bit surprised that they went with the classic Burberry font here because recently on their social media, they have been pushing for their more modern uh, sans serif looking design. But this looks very nice. The paper that is used on the bag is textured and the text is embossed. It feels very, very nice. At the top of the bag is a bow that looks like this. Let's undo it and pull this out. The bow is made of some kind of thick cloth. It feels kind of nice in the hands. From my experience with buying with luxury brands, they usually like to make you feel special for buying their products. So the receipt for the purchase is usually placed in an envelope that looks a little bit like this. This is what the box looks like. And it comes with a card. It says on the top, thank you for shopping with us. Happy holidays, Paragon Burberry. I'm really excited. Let's get into this box. Let's slide this out. Okay. Same material for the ribbon as before. The box that the product comes in feels nice and sturdy. Very nice. And we slide this out. Inside the box is obviously my purchase with a nice thin brown wrapping paper around it. There's a gold sticker over here that says Burberry. Let's peel this off. Oh yeah! Look at that beautiful deep red. Perfect for the Lunar New Year of the box. And here we go. This is the red vintage check detail jersey hooded top by Burberry. So here you go. This is the hood. And on the inside of the hood, you have the classic vintage check design. I was considering between the M size and L size, whether or not to wear it as an oversized hoodie or a properly fitted hoodie. In the end, I chose the M size. Let's take a closer look at the details. So on the left chest, you can see the Burberry logo embroidered into the hoodie. Here's the zipper. It's a beautiful big zipper with the Burberry logo uh, written on it right there. The zip is thick, metallic, nice and bright and should be smooth all the way to the bottom. Very nice. Around the hoodie there are drawstrings obviously and on the tip of the drawstring is once again, the Burberry logo. The Burberry vintage check design goes all the way from the hoodie all the way down to the bottom of the hoodie. As you would expect, they tried to match up the, the prints of the vintage check design as far as possible. However, because of the direction of the hoodie being slightly angled away from the direction of this, the lining will never be absolutely perfect. On the inside of the hoodie, Burberry has chosen to go with their vintage check design once again to be used as stitching for the jacket. This is a detail that probably won't be seen by 95% of the people that see this jacket, but I find it really nice. This is what the brand tag for the Burberry jacket looks like. Very nice. And it is attached to some paperwork. It describes what item you purchased and some extra foreign language information. And finally on the inside left corner of the hoodie, you'll find a tag that contains information about what materials were used in producing this jacket. I find it really interesting that the tag at the corner of the inside of the jacket 
has a really really beautiful material too just look at that wow all right so there you have it that's my quick look at the vintage check detail jersey hooded top from burberry in a beautiful luscious red perfectly timed for lunar new year i hope you guys enjoyed today's unboxing don't forget to leave a comment a like a subscribe and i wish you guys a happy lunar new year take care guys